In the last week, Iranian Foreign Minister Hossein Amir Abdullahian paid a visit to Baku to hold talks with top Azari officials regarding bilateral, regional, and international issues. As his first visit to Azerbaijan in Reis' administration, he met with the Azari President Ilham Aliyev to exchange views on regional developments. During the visit, he underscored that a new chapter of ties between both countries has been on the horizon. Iran is ready to finish all remaining projects, paving the way for embarking on the more and novel deals between the two nations, he added. Refereeing Tehran's presence in the 3 plus 3 format, Iran's top diplomat regarded such efforts as detrimental to any threats to the region. The Azari president, for his part, called the ties between the two Muslim and neighboring countries indispensable, as saying that Baku is willing to deepen ties in all political, economic, and cultural areas. He also considered his recent meeting with his Iranian counterpart, Ebrahim Raisi, in Ashgabat on the sidelines of the Eco Summit as fruitful. Later on, Iran's top diplomat held talks with the Speaker of the Republic of Azerbaijan's National Assembly, Sahiba Gafarova. The two officials discussed ways of strengthening the ties between the two countries in different areas, including parliamentary cooperation. Amir Abdullahian said the presence of the Speaker of Azerbaijan's National Assembly at the inauguration ceremony of the Iranian president shows the depth of friendly relations between the two countries. He added that the unique commonalities between Iran and the Republic of Azerbaijan are a great asset for the two countries, paving the ground for the development of bilateral ties. During his visit to Baku, Amir Abdullahian visited the Shahidlar Martiz Lane monument and paid tribute to those who lost their lives during the First and Second Karabakh Wars. He also expressed anticipation that all yearning for the liberation of all occupied territories of Palestine and the establishment of a unified Palestinian government with Al-Quds as its capital will see the doomsday. The Iranian foreign minister also sat down with his Azari opposite number, Jehun Bayramov, to share views on areas and ways of boosting mutual cooperation. Underlining the continuation of cooperation in other economic fields, namely encouraging and boosting interactions between the private sectors of both countries, Amir Abdullahian recalled the importance of collaboration in the fields of transportation and energy. The two top diplomats also underlined the significance of a joint committee on media cooperation to keep working together. In this regard, Tehran and Baku reached the MOU in media relations. Last but not least, both agreed on the cooperation of construction of those lands liberated in the 44-day war in 2020, as confirmed by the Iran's Deputy Foreign Minister for Economic Diplomacy, Mehdi Safari, who was accompanying Foreign Minister Amir Abdullahian. قولی که داده شد که ما رو در پروژه‌های بزرگی مشارکت بده ان شاءالله من بعد از چند روزی بعد می‌گردم اینجا که راجع به پروژه‌ها به صورت ری صحبت کنیم من فکر کنم سر سقف بالای خواهد بود و می‌تونه یک فضای جدید شغلی برای ما در بازسازی در منطقه آزاد شده ایجاد کنه he also said that the gas swap deal between Iran, Turkmenistan, and the Republic of Azerbaijan will initiate as of early January. As announced earlier, Iran has prioritized the role of its neighboring countries in the improvement of all its sectors, as well as the preservation of security and stability in the region. Reporting from Tehran Times, have a good day.